Okay, it's been about an hour, and I've been waiting. Well, actually, I've been doing lots of other stuff. But I'm taking off the plastic wrap, and maybe you can see that it's all bubbly. So let's see if I can move this so you can see how bubbly it is. And if I stick my finger in, it doesn't come back out. And that means it's ready. The first rice is done. So I'm going to bring it down using my pastry scraper and shape it. Now this looks like it'll make a lot of bread, and it will. Um, it's plenty for my husband and me, probably for about a week, but if we have guests it might not last that long. I'm going to shape a few of them to show you my technique for shaping. There's lots of ways. Some people say roll them in a ball. I never got them in balls. So I just take a piece of bread and I shape it like that, pitch it off with my hands, and that's how I make a roll. So once I get these all shaped, I'll cover them again with the same plastic wrap. It's been oiled well, so it won't stick to the top. And I'll let them rise another hour. While they're rising, I will be preheating the oven because I use a pizza stone, a baking stone, to make the bread crisper on the bottom if it's very hot. And I use a very hot oven. So I will preheat my oven to 460, and I will... Uh, make sure that it's all hot and it will take about an hour for the pizza stone to get hot enough. So as soon as I get done with this, I will start the oven and then we'll be ready for the next part. 